tough weekend, obviously. You know, tough weekend in a lot of ways. You know, when you say goodbye to your seniors, that's a that that gets to be a tough thing. Um, you know, but appreciate everything that those guys have done for our team. Um, the the amount of work and sacrifice that those guys have have done for the program, it's incredible. I mean, it's immense. And, and you know, the bond that those guys have, it's going to be a lifelong thing. And, uh, you know, we had a post-meet social the other night, and, and after it, all the guys got up and talked. And, you know, it was really, it was, uh, you know, it's really cool to, to see how these guys have grown as men throughout the years and to see, you know, thinking about where they were four or five years ago and where they are now, you know, they're in a much better place. And that's, that's part of what I know my job is. I'll say one thing about Adam Perrin. I tell you what, <laughs> It's pretty hard not to smile when you think about that kid uh, and, and what he's done for our team and, and you know how he competed on, on Friday night. I know that he probably never thought he was going to compete in the West GM. I remember he told me, or I told, he told some of his teammates, you know, I was, I was the only guy that out of my class that didn't get, get to compete in the West GM. Well, he got to compete in the West GM and he got to, he got to feel a lot of that love and energy. And I tell you what, uh, it was great to see the smile on his face at the end of that match. And that was a huge match for us, you know, really a turning point in the meet and give us a chance to, to win that meet, so um, you know we kind of come off a couple losses, and man, he 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 rebounded for us really well, and and, and really put things in direction where you know we gave ourselves a chance to win that meet, but um, you know got to be able to put some more points on the board. Uh, you know, one thing I'll say about uh, North Dakota State and, and Kish is you know they get their guys to hustle. I mean, they, if you if you've watched them wrestle, they're always hustling on the edge or hustling back to the center. Um, you know, so he, so he does a good job having their guys uh, you know really fight you know for for. All. For a whole seven minutes, so you know our guys have to. They know that going in that we're going to have to compete like that. Um, you know, and they have some other good guys sprinkled in, but you know, 84 has been an All-American before, and their 2500 has been been in the rankings all year. Um, and I know there's some uh, some other guys that that are in, you know in the mix, but you know those are those are the the big two guys.